Hey guys, check it out. We got the amazing Jamaguchi Tomaru Chingaraki Awakened version. Now, this pre order went up, uh, I think, last night. Sorry that I didn't cover earlier, but like I said, I'm on vacation. I was actually making my way to where I'm staying, so I wasn't able to cover it, but I'm gonna cover it now. So, you guys can see here, it's gonna be released on August of next year you have a price of 79 US dollars with 43 cents normal price is around 92 so yeah this normally amazing gem Gucci's they tend to be around 100 US dollars but some websites like Hobbling Japan here Amiyami normally tend to lower the pricing of quite a bit you can actually darn I think I've got an amazing gem Gucci figures for like I don't know 55 60 around that price range but let's check it out because this is a figure that a lot of people really enjoyed in the last video that I did that I have read but like I said in that video the hair separation looks great um, the eyes look awesome the mouth with the damaged lip of course that ripped up cape which looks great even if it's plastic I wish it was fabric it's still looking great um darn the muscles the abs the way they sculpted them looks great even the separation line here the seam line here still looks pretty darn good and of course you got that arm with the brownish color going up to the hand which looks great and the legs look awesome as well so check it out here with these um, back spikes or whatever you want to call them back I think um, it should give us the info here I mean it says main figure interchangeable bangs interchangeable face interchangeable hands collapse effect part oh so that is the collapse effect part we got the rivets rivet attachment or maybe there are the rivets actually it's actually this yeah the rivets we got the strut extension parts and the display stand, like all amazing Jimaguchis. Comes with the display stand, and by the way, this looks awesome. And they, it just looks so good because you have the black, but you also have the orange colors to them, the reddish orange, which really that's a part. And I like how they also color the ball joint here, the joint for the elbow, just to you know make it look everything. Um, smooth which is great and here you can see the other bangs making it look even more diabolical that he is check it out there and let me check the stand because this is the one two three okay this is the normal one I wish it was the the four joint one because the four joint one is a lot taller and it gives you more options if you want to do aerial poses that's the stand from Amazing Jamaguchi that you want so here articulation is great ankle no articulation this this guy is looking really awesome oh I just noticed this that there's a hole here that's really good attention to detail Check it out here. See for this pose, if you have the four joint one, you can do it so easily. With the three one, you gonna have to play around a little bit, but still, that's pretty awesome, man. With the mouth, he has the teeth, looking, looking pretty hard, cool. Get out there, and just. It just swapping out the faces adds so much emotion to a single pose which is really awesome here as well here's the effect part which looks great maybe I, I know some people are gonna be like yeah it should have been a little bit bigger yeah I think so yes looking great now I'm pretty sure the knee here, this kneecap here, you can move it 
up or down I think or I could be wrong honestly maybe this one doesn't have it but um my amazing Jimmy Spider-Man Iron the Iron Spider actually does this um where yeah the the knee is gonna look like this but you can actually push it back or push it forward and to hide it which is great to hide this part and it doesn't look that bad look how good like, that looks that looks awesome that looks awesome and I love how the light hits it and because of the way they did the paint some areas look a, more, a lot more reddish and the other ones look a lot more orange and that's pretty cool that they did that check that Oh man, it, I am telling you, this scar here, that, that looks, that looks like a real scar, that looks great. Yeah, even how they even out of the mall. And the, the paint job that they did here for the face is really hard, cool. There's the other hair with the other bangs. You guys saw that, look at this. Part here looks looks a little bit less reddish. Oh man, that's creepy. Pretty creepy. But they 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 did this so well. Like look, look how big the scar looks now. But obviously with the open mouth, but it looks looks so natural. What an awesome job they did here. So you get four different faces, you get the effect part, which actually looking at it right now, it looks a lot bigger. Uh, you get the attachment point for these, which is pretty awesome. You also have the attachment point for the stand. You got the different hands and the extra bang of hair. So that's pretty cool. This is a really awesome figure. Um, if I was into my Hero Academia, I would definitely pick this up like this is a must get this is a must get honestly for you your academia fans yeah cool so here's the code here's the jan code it's the release date 31 is just placeholder it could be anywhere from the first to the 15 to the 31st like it depends unless it gets the delayed or anything like that um remember that there is a uh, there is a think is a, a extra face that you can get if you prefer from Kyoto's website. But remember, if you get from Kyoto's website, you're gonna be paying a um, hundred bucks easy. You're gonna be paying full price. But yeah, that does it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, comment, subscribe for more, and Merry Christmas.